the most important thing you need to know is that you are not created to think like others. You're not created to see things like others. You are unique. So you do not have to compete with others. You get what I'm saying? Because if you compete with others at the end of the day, you do not know how these people who are thinking the way they were thinking, how they were wired. Yeah. Each one of us is wired differently. Yeah. So basically, you don't have to compete with anybody. If there is anything that you need to compete with, is the standard that you want, mm. the mark that you have placed for yourself. That's what you need to compete with. Mm. And so if you have, um, you know, the world within you is well under cool. We call it under key and lock. You know, you, you don't allow your mind just to go haywire. You, you are able to control your thinking and your thoughts and line them up according to the world above you, according to the supreme being that you worship, according to God. You mm. get what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah, as revealed in his word. Then you will come to appreciate yourself for who you are mm. and you want to do things according to your way and your style and not somebody else's way or style. Okay.